<laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Mad Lately. Mm-hmm. I'm Rose Kranzvik. Game G- C. Gina Views. Okay. And we got Slink Johnson, hey. a.k.a. Black Jesus. Hey, what up? We in this thing. No <laughs> jumper, man. No <laughs> jumper. And we mad lately. I'm real mad. <laughs> what has you mad lately? It's a bunch of shit, man. It's just, you know what I'm saying? It's just watching shit from, you know, just watching the world go crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? It's, these mercies and shit, these niggas in these tight ass pants, you know what I'm talking about? Mm-hmm. Uh, just all these atrocities happening all over the world, just mm-hmm. all kinds of shit. You know, niggas, mama's acting like they too too much for TV now. I, it's just I'm mad about a lot of shit. I think <laughs> I think we should open the show with the with the Black Jesus prayer for all these mm-hmm. uh, all these things to change them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and we have a lot of haters yeah. in the world. We have a lot of haters <clears throat> in my comments too. Yeah, there's a lot of haters in your comments yeah. Yeah. right now. Yeah, well, that's yeah. they the just hating. Well, look. That's where you at. You in the comments. You see where we at? We <laughs> over here bleachers. chilling, doing real one shit. You know what I'm talking about? We doing real shit right here. No jumper, man. You know, mad lately. People always going to have comments. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times, you know, they come with that old bullshit, you know, in the comments with the whole tough talking shit and, you know, all the disparaging remarks. But as soon as they see us, they want to just immediately put a nigga mouth, put their mouth on a nigga phallus. Like, what up? Hey, <laughs> Fucking fun boy talking all that shit. And then we suck dick when you see a nigga. <laughs> Fuck you, <laughs> nigga. So yeah, so yeah, we should uh, we we should uh, we should pray for them. Well, we're gonna pray for them. Okay. Uh-huh. Dear Heavenly Father, we come to you today and we ask that this microphone don't short out on me again, Lord. I come to you, Lord, humble and obedient, and I ask, Lord, that you give everybody what they need to have. Mm-hmm. To be themselves and to love themselves, so they don't hate on nobody else. What else that got? What else nobody else got going on? Lord, I want to thank you for the lotion that Gina rubbed on them ankles <laughs> before the show started, making sure that her femininity is always highlighted. You know what I'm saying? Making sure her skin is always moist and supple and soft for a real player to rub on. You know what I'm talking about? Dear Lord, I want to, I want to, I want to say thank you for Rosecrans Vicks nice, nice sunglasses, Lord. And I pray that the that the feds never come investigate that brother on the strength of his sunglasses, believing that he got thirty seven kilos of good Peruvian powder in his trunk, Lord. And last but not least, Lord, I pray that Gabe gets the woman he's looking for, Lord, because I know he's mm-hmm. been following them women's thirst traps on Instagram, <laughs> double tapping every damn thing on the timeline. Lord, please let this man get some trim that's going to love him forever and ever. Amen. 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 Yeah. you going to get some trim. Thank you. you going to get some trim. I appreciate it. <laughs> Happy 20th episode, man. Yeah, that we made a, it a 20. Pr- the prayer for the 20. Yeah. The 2 <laughs> Dumb, yeah. Nigga. What up? That was hilarious. Um, <laughs> so, uh, Gina, what has you met lately? Rent. It's due every month. Like every single month is due. We don't get no mm-hmm. breaks on rent. We don't get no breaks on bills or anything. Like that shit is crazy. There's it's no due. vacation. Yeah, they rent. don't give out coupons, no discount calls or nothing. I just want. I'm just happy that. To hear that you still striving to pay for it, because there's a lot of people that can pay rent that's not paying rent now. <laughs> and you know, that moratorium is going to be over soon. If folks are going to want their money, you need to be trying to pay that rent. You know, I mean, if you got it, if you ain't got it, man, it is what it is, man. God bless you, you know what I'm saying? And just make it the best way you can. But if you know you got them folks' money, you need to pay it. <laughs> just saying. Oh mm-hmm. shit! Uh, what has you met lately, Gabe? Hmm. You ever come up with someone like um, you know, like you, uh, your car wash man, or maybe your barber? My in my in my deal, it's my barber right now. We started from the bottom both, but right now I feel like he's just progressing way too fast. Mm. Like he's jumping prices ten dollars every fucking three months, and is his skill. Is his skill is his skill uh, uh, matching that? Or? Yeah, kinda, sorta, kinda. I think it's just more the area he's in. Oh, mm. he's in a rich, rich part of Long Beach, so oh. he's getting like Belmont up Shore? there. Like today, he no, not today. Three days ago, he canceled my my um, my appointment because he said straight up to me, "There's a guy that's willing to pay double what you're paying me." 
And I was like, damn. Damn. Did y'all barber? I was yeah, gonna, I was like, I, we were know, grinding I, together. We had five years of relationship. This, like, and that barber must, he must <laughs> assure you that he doesn't cut a yee yee haircut. Yeah. I'm gonna ask you to take your hat off uh, yeah. off camera because you might have a yee yee cut. Well, what was you doing? I don't this show yeah, you watch your hair. Let blue. me see. Yeah, wait, let me see. Hmm? Your edge is looking like blue right here. What was you, you doing? This? What did I do? Wait, let's see your hair. How much blue. he charge? How much he charge? Huh? How much he charge you? Right now he's charging me forty five. So he said that he was getting yep. a good. Is belly. he in your shit with clippers or just scissors? No, he's doing cl uh, clippers. He's doing the whole thing. Taper fade, lineup. So you guys are being oh, yeah. for forty five dollars a haircut. The bitch is supposed to be on your dick immediately. <laughs> you ain't even supposed to get out the know. chair without the bitches <laughs> on your dick. That was actually a Twitter argument. Are you supposed to pay fifty dollars? Fifty dollars normal for a haircut? Or that's I a, mean, that's how much it, I pay it, now. Yeah. yeah, you pay fifty dollars. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the haircut is, is once a week, right? Yeah, I get Y'all niggas week. is yeah. something else. You better go on Amazon and get you some clippers. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? And I just, you know, <laughs> hey man, my shit grow. <laughs> but in the pandemic with the barbershops being fucked up, I'm like, fuck it, I don't know how to cut a fade. I'm just gonna whack all this shit off. <laughs> fuck that. It ain't no fade fly enough for $50. That fade better last, nigga, for a month, nigga. <laughs> for a month. And I just better be peeling bitches off my damn bitch. Bitch. I just be peeling them off my dick. They for 50 bucks. And then the nigga want a tip. Man. Yeah, I know. And That's I was crazy. just like, damn. The fact that you told me that straight up is crazy. That's it's, fucked up. It's, it's, it's honestly, you have a sense of integrity. I fuck with it. But um, mm. damn, I gotta move on. You do, bro. He yeah. he treating you like that a regular. Nigga, yeah, he yeah. gotta have a fucking loyalty program going on. So <laughs> yeah. you started with that nigga. Sometimes you gotta That's pull a saying. nigga to the side. Like, nigga, look here. <laughs> hey. I want to see you win, my nigga. I'm supporting your bi in this. You understand what I'm talking about? But look here, man. You know what this is. You're gonna stop hitting me with these uh, uh, exorbitant ass uh, mm -hmm. uh, raises and prices, my nigga. We're gonna stop that right now, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> What's that nigga name? Yeah, yeah. What's his name? No, I'm, not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna put him like hey, that. Hey, nigga, the nigga that cut Gabe here. <laughs> You better stall that nigga out. This is a motherfucking pandemic right now. Nigga, we in the middle of motherfucking quarantine. Yeah. Fuck with that man. He wants some bitches on his dick, man. That nigga's penis ain't felt no vaginal moisture in a long time. Get that nigga hair right so he can get some bitches on his dick, man. You know what I'm talking about? Everybody need a little vaginal moisture around their phallic tool. You know what I'm talking about? This is not the episode for her to watch. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you yeah. got I'm somebody at home watching. Yeah. Apologize. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's okay. She understands. She's cool. Oh, She's with so. it. What what has you met lately, Vic? Um toxic relationships. <laughs> <laughs> Are you in a toxic relationship? I, I I don't even know at this point. <laughs> um, did you do anything yesterday? I did. Um, so basically, what happened was I woke up at three in the morning on my couch with a bumping headache, fully clothed, and I was like, "Yo, this is like the worst Valentine's Day ever." Like, okay. Yeah, I mean, bro, I woke up fully clothed. Like, okay, but what couch. did you do before you got home? What was the take went, us through your to Sunday? No, I mean, like, I went to brunch. You took you know, her to brunch? Took her to brunch, you know, uh -huh. a little $200 joint. You know, Ooh, whatever, got some like, mimosas popping? Some mimosas, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Like, okay. And then some some joke I made yesterday, like, somebody sent it to her or something. She on got some, mad. On Twitter? I don't know. I don't like, sound I mean, like she was holding a tweet in. You need like to go that. pull up on her other nigga. I don't know. At like, night. I don't No, no, no. Like, she can't. Look, she left. She, like, gave me the flowers I gave to her. She gave them back to me. And I'm like, what the fuck am I going to do with these? And then she left. Then she came back. Then she left again. I'm like, this is too much. Now, what time did y'all leave brunch? I don't know, like, one. And what time y'all got back to your house? Like, like, 1.30. I don't know. P.M.? No, like. Oh, A.M.? Where did no, y'all go? No, not A.M. Not, yeah, P.M. Sorry, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. And then you went to sleep? No, I didn't go to no. Like I just, I was just kicking it, and then she called me. She's like, "I'm coming back," and I'm like, "Okay." Oh shit! And then she, came, yeah, and then she came back, and then was the way we're chilling, and then she like was like, "Nah, I gotta leave." Well, like, shout out to sis. Sound like she went to dinner with another nigga. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. Is this the this the same this same the same what? one? Same what? Oh, you like her? <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, the same what? I don't know. Because about point. two episodes ago, he wasn't fucking with her. Mm. 
Oh. Or it's a new one. We don't know. It's a, who knows? We don't know. Who knows? Maybe. Who really knows? Who knows? Yeah. Slink, what are we doing? <laughs> I, wanna, I, I wish I could have. Uh, you know, did some shit like that. I, I planned this nice little little Valentine's Day for this special lady, man. Nice little shit, man. We was going to go to the dog fight. And, uh, you know, we was going to hang out and watch the pit bulls fight. And then after that, you know, we was going to go to the street races and shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, shit. That's a night. And hang out in front of the liquor store. We was going to cap the night off in front of the gangster store. You know what I'm saying? But the bitch didn't call me. I told her it was going to be a fun-filled evening. You know what I mean? I had my oh, tuxedo shit. on and everything for the dog fight. Damn. Were you gonna change for the for the street race? Excuse me. Were you gonna change or were you gonna wear the same suit for oh, the street race? Oh, just my jacket and my boots. Okay. Just my jacket and my <laughs> boots. You know what I'm saying? I was gonna try to switch it up for. So when you take the pictures, it looked like we did a whole lot that day, but nigga mm -hmm. really didn't do much. You know what I'm saying? It's cool. Hey, they be street racing like up and down Wilmington because I live on Wilmington. I hear that shit all the time, like mm -hmm. at one in the morning. Like, I tell you, man, the motherfucker. Twenty cars every Sunday. <laughs> Fast and furious. <laughs> Fast and furious. Gabe, you're never a racer? Nah, my cousins and my brother were. Like, I, I went to them. Yeah. Literally, like, where the industrial place is, mm -hmm. where the 91 is. Like, yeah. if you go down those, like, little streets. Be gone yeah, there was, there. like, I remember, like, being, like, 15, 16, going with them. He was like, don't say anything. And then just, like, 50 cars in a row. And they're yeah. just going pairs and pairs. Pairs and pairs. Pairs and pairs. Two by two, like Noah bringing them up in the <laughs> arc. <laughs> so what, what, what car are you bringing? You bringing the OGs, the... Oh man, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, you know. I, um, the scrape? I don't know. I was thinking about pulling out the uh, the Gremlin. Oh, the Gr Gremlin? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Is that yeah, the one that Lil Bow Wow pulled out in Tokyo Drift? I, I don't know what that nigga Lil Bow Wow. I, I don't fuck with Lil Bow Wow too much, man. Nah. I, I like my nigga, man, but I don't know. Lil Bow Wow just be doing too much sometimes, mm. man. I don't know, man. That's my little guy, man. <laughs> That's he's a good guy. He's a good guy, yeah, he's man. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. Like Michael was a classic. Yeah. <laughs> like my guess, like one class Mike under the belt. was a classic. Yeah. I go to 2008. Roll bounce. Roll bounce. I got a, like I got, Mike was better. I got what about a jet, lottery ticket? I got no, a jet like Mike was like way Bow better. Was it? It? I got a jet just like the one Bow I got. You do? Yeah. Go back. Go back. Go back in the internet. And look at Bow I know. Jet. I know what you're referring to. <laughs> they sleep. They still stuck on Valentine's Day. Yeah, I know. Hmm. Yeah. It was fake. How was your Valentine's Day? Because the nigga loved it. You couldn't wait. Yeah, how was your Valentine's Day? It was cool. What did you get? Flowers. This nigga said, what did you get? Eight Ooh. out? <laughs> nah, 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 wait, wait. Wait, nah. What did you get for Valentine's Day? Eight out? <laughs> you got flowers? Somebody sent you flowers? No, one of my friends um, came over and gave me some flowers, and we went to dinner. That's what I'm talking one about. One of your friends? Mm -hmm. Like yeah. a female friend? Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about. That's, That's what funny. I'm talking about. I feel like um, Slink has a, a tweet for this occasion. <laughs> Ooh, I had a bunch of tweets for this uh, occasion. Something about mismanaging... Oh yes, I, I say it's crazy how chicks will have four or five guys in their rotation all year, but on Valentine's Day they be looking lonely, hanging out with their homegirls and shit. Y'all bitches be mismanaging your pussies. You really mismanaging your pussies, and you, I'm you not a new manager. Just manage the motherfucker a little bit better, cause you're giving your pussies to the wrong guy. How do you manage your pussy the correct way? You manage your pussy correctly by you look at the character of the guy. You don't look at the performance <laughs> of the penis. You look at the character of the character. You know what I'm talking about? You check him mm. out. And just is this the kind of nigga that's gonna check on me on Valentine's Day, even though he might be at home with his wife? Is this nigga gonna send me some Grubhub and some flowers? <laughs> <laughs> is he gonna make me feel like something you know what I'm talking about cause I told you it's only 24 hours in a day but we are not gonna get into that you know what I'm talking about but thanks to technology mm -hmm. Grubhub can be there when I can't you understand me and you just put my picture in front of the meal you eat that meal and I'm there <laughs> that sound like mismanaging too <clears throat> no it's not at least you eat yeah but you're not there at least you but at least you eat these niggas you won't eat for it these niggas will fuck you on an empty stomach <laughs> <laughs> These niggas, I'm telling you, I'm getting older, and you call it tricking or whatever, because young niggas don't like buying shit. But mm -hmm. I'm getting a little bit older, and I don't mind. You nigga, you want some pussy? Buy her something to eat, man. She, you, bitches is better when they mind is at ease. They ain't worried about they stomach. You know what I'm talking about? Buy the bitch something to eat. Bitches fuck better and suck dick on an empty stomach, my nigga. They don't. I mean, they don't suck dick on an empty stomach. You gotta, you know. Feed them, my nigga. So at least a nigga make sure you eat. You know what I'm talking about? You get some fine, uh, what's them, what's them, a uh, Whitman sampler? You know what I'm talking about? Get you a fine Whitman sampler with the little yep. strawberries and nuts and shit. You like mm. that, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> 
No. This is not about me. <laughs> <laughs> she mad at the Whitman Sapler. <laughs> I'm on C's. All right. C's next year. <laughs> you gotta work. You gotta work your way up. You know these niggas. These girls be wanting shit for nothing. Y'all ain't even did nothing to deserve it, shit. You know what I'm saying? First date, first time a nigga take you out. You want to go to Glassstone, bitch? If you don't go to Long John Silver's and enjoy that uh, number two and work your <laughs> yep. way up, is Long John Silver's this month? <laughs> next date, you might fuck around and move up to Fridays. I don't know. Yeah. Fridays. Fridays. That's facts. Fridays. 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 There's you levels. You know, know. it's levels. You just yeah. don't get a job. Job and they put you, they don't promote you the mm -hmm. first day. You got to perform. Based on your experience, you you already come in at a great position. Based on based your experience. Based on your experience. Yeah. Ba well, based on your experience, it's going to be how fast you move up. If you experience, you know what to do to move up. Yeah. <laughs> but exactly. You build. I ain't starting that Friday. So. Uh -huh. No, you know, you didn't start Friday. You started Long John <laughs> <laughs> It's a couple. It's a couple stops oh, between Fridays and Long John Silver's. You know what I'm saying? You got you got a couple stops. You know what I'm saying? You got you got to work your way up. You know what I'm saying? Like it's a marriage system. You don't just yeah. fucking like these guys be too quick to shower these girls with shit. I don't even exactly. know you. What have you done to deserve Real that? Shit. Take me. I want a Louis purse, <laughs> bitch. I'm gonna go to Food for Less. You better put all that bullshit mm -hmm. in this bag right here, and you work your way up. Because right now, you're nothing. You're just chum fish. And then when you work your way up, eventually you work your way up from chum fish to shrimp, from shrimp so to So why lobster. guys can't work their way up to getting pussy? We do work our way up. No, y'all expect pussy off of Long John Silver's. <laughs> it's optional. Well, you you're not on an empty stomach. You, you, yeah. hung, you hungry, right? Yeah. No. <laughs> I fed myself already. Oh, Tina right. looks pissed. <laughs> no. all right. All right. She just had PTSD of we're Long John Silver. Yeah. We're gonna, all right, we're gonna leave. We're I've actually never had Long John Silver's or Arby's. It's, Gina, Long John Silver's is fire, though. You, really? would, you a bad one, yeah. Gina. I'll start you off with California Fish Grill. California oh. Fish Grill. And then you get the clam chowder I on the know, side. Josh or whatever not over you here want. shaking his head. <laughs> California Fish Grill is fire. It's, it's fire. top tier. It's pretty good. That's, that's a, that's a dinner I'll take you to anniversary. That's an anniversary dinner, I can dinner, make for that sure. at home. I want something that I can't cook. Mm. <laughs> but what? the swai, swai got, got some recipe to it that is like, the garlic butter, I don't think you can make that script. Oh, you didn't see my story this weekend? It was, mm, I, I didn't see I it. I didn't see it. I didn't yeah. see it. I want to see the garlic butter. <laughs> yeah, you have a picture of it? I you want to see the garlic us? butter. <laughs> what's, uh, what's the wildest thing you guys seen this uh, Valentine's weekend on, on Instagram? Mm. I've seen some great. Um, I've seen some some niggas doing it up. Uh, what's his name? Michael B. Jordan rented mm -hmm. out the aquarium. Mm. He did. Damn. Yeah, he for Lori Harvey. High as fuck. For Lori Harvey. Yeah. I would run an aquarium out for her. I said I couldn't. Shit, half these bitches I know I wouldn't rent no aquarium out for them. Bitch, smell like one anyway. <laughs> <laughs> bitch. You wouldn't take her home. <laughs> This smell like swai. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm talking shit, Gina. This ain't directed towards you. Now. Yeah, Gina's I know. Jesus, my know beautiful queen. Good. You know that, yeah, because you smell good. I seen you rub the fragrant lotion on your ankles. It still smell like pomegranate in this motherfucker. See, you lying because it's vanilla. See, you ain't it's going. Vanilla. You ain't vanilla fucking going with it. Two You're not going things. with it. I'm giving you a compliment. You're not going smell with it. Smell my hand. Let me see. <laughs> Yeah. What'd you think? <laughs> if it's not vanilla, it's. I mean, it's vanilla, but it, <laughs> it, it don't smell like that Bed Bath and Beyond vanilla. It smell like it's that Ross vanilla. No. Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> I mean, it's vanilla though. No, 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 no. That's oh, bad. Bath and Body Works. <laughs> oh shit. Mm, yeah, mm. get you a swig of that. No, nah, my baby mama, she she probably need like one of these for one ankle, like <laughs> not even not even both ankles, both sides, like just one ankle. You know, that's why I don't buy that and shit. I rub motor oil on her. <laughs> don't do that. <it. laughs> motor oil. <laughs> Lubricate that ass. Bitch got all the miles on her. <laughs> I'll take a shot. I'll take a shot for that. I'll take a shot for that. Oh my goodness! Yeah, um, future. 
and his girlfriend have matching chains. Did y'all see that? It's really cute. Future got a drawer full of them chains. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to my nigga Future. I love Future. He's a real player, and I'm just making jokes because I, I fuck with you, Future. I love you. But this nigga Future goes through all. I wonder, that nigga got an ironic name because, bitch, do you actually see a future with Future? <laughs> <laughs> bitch, how ironic, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> and these bitches just, that's how I just say some of you bitches is just dumb as a box of rocks. Why they dumb? Because you just, I mean, okay, if not dumb, then not necessarily truthful with themselves. How? If you, I'm, I'm looking for love and I'm looking for my everything, bitch, you're not going to find it with Future. Future going to knock you down on the balcony in Dubai, give you a motherfucking a chain as a parting gift. <laughs> you're not gonna get that but I mean, you, you still go that? after them niggas but why you don't go after Ronnie the bus driver because that they fuck you been, on an empty stomach that's what you just no, said no Ronnie the bus driver been cool he been working that job for 20 but years he don't got he that been, AP <laughs> watching that drawer like what the fuck the Casio tell the same time mm -hmm. the AP do look either you, bar. either you gonna either you gonna leave with something you gonna leave with nothing yeah okay exactly exactly so are you coming are, so is, are, is the lady in this situation coming in with dynamic neck with outstanding double jointed uh, <laughs> motherfucking uh, windpipe. Can she tie her windpipe in a knot and serve it to this man on if the platter? It, if I'm it's future, she you might. I'm just saying, she coming in with all these prerequisites and shit. I'm telling you, Ronnie the bus driver. Ronnie the bus driver, he cool. He a little overweight. Yeah. He missing a couple teeth, but the yeah. nigga nice and he can cook. But Ronnie and, is not going to sound good in the group chat. But Ronnie is missing teeth, first of all. But Ronnie, Ronnie is, is missing Ronnie is, I don't give a fuck. Ronnie, Ronnie is nice teeth. to you. Ronnie missing teeth. Ronnie tea. is nice to you. No. And some of these women is missing the motherfucking father's name on their child's birth certificate, but ain't nobody saying nothing about it. Well, <laughs> future's nice too. I'm just saying. That's some facts. <laughs> he missed a lot no. of shit too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the but Ronnie's nice. I can't, Ronnie cares I can't for his flex mama. Ronnie. Oh, that's what you want. Also, you don't want love. Yeah. You don't want the nigga to love you. You want the nigga you can flex with. Just, love is, that is what, temporary. It's all temporary. The, you, you, it's all temporary. The nigga that love you. Ain't nobody The nigga your, that love you. Nobody yours is just your turn. I didn't say so. yours. I say the nigga that love you. The nigga that love your dirty motherfucking drawers and your ankles when they not mo uh, Valentine vanilla lo lotion on them. You, you, you want that nigga? You don't want that nigga to love you when you ain't got no vanilla lotion Not on if you. he not who I want. I'm not settling. I don't care who he love. I'm not settling if I want him. I heard the fuck out of that. That's why I think that that very sentiment is why I think a lot of women is going to die the fuck alone. <laughs> <laughs> they going to die the fuck alone. You so know, I'm about you, to settle you, for what I know. I'm not, telling you, I'm not telling you to settle at all. I'm not telling you to settle at all as much as I'm saying to compromise. Mm. To compromise. You I'm not go, compromising you don't see for old no women, peace. Old women die. You go to their funeral. They ain't got no man. Uh, old men, they die. It's some old bitch. Bernadine loved his ass. Look what you asking to compromise. Like you not asking to compromise on no kids. You asking to compromise on no teeth. It was teeth. It's the teeth for me. It's a bunch of shit, though, motherfucker missing. Like, shit, it, it, it's, it's a lot of shit. You got to look beyond the image, though. That's what I'm saying. You look me You just, you say well, yeah, you, I, you, I say you want age. somebody you want to flex. Yeah. You want somebody you want to flex. I'm not at that age. I want somebody that I'm attracted to. If I'm not, I'm not flexing Ronnie with no teeth. Flex on, flex on. <laughs> flex on, baby. Flex on, flex on. He could get his teeth fixed. Flex on, That's flex on. That's not my on. problem. Would you, would y'all, you fuck a bitch with no teeth? Let's just be realistic. Yes, I will, and I have, and I'll do it again. <laughs> you are However, it makes for a better time. Yeah. It makes for better oral stimulation. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm talking about? When you... That's neither here nor there. <laughs> so, yeah, I started off with Aaron Magruder. <laughs> <laughs> it got me. This nigga got me off. This, this nigga got me off this uh this bargain store TQ right here. Hey, Kirkman is not bargain store. It's top tier bargain I didn't, store. I didn't want to say the... what. The, I didn't want to give the people no, no shot because they ain't gave us no money. They ain't gave us no money. But you know, we it's just top tier though. We just talking shit. Sometimes mm -hmm. I can get a little bit passionate about mm -hmm. this man woman relationship mm -hmm. thing. You know, it's a lot of this shit is a crock of bullshit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I think that uh, I think social media destroy relationships for everybody, men and women alike. We constantly chasing something. You know what I'm saying? The social media, I'm scrolling every night, every day, every night. Wake up first thing in the morning, scrolling, 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 looking at my bitch like, you ain't good enough. Bitch, you are not good enough. Look at this bitch here. You know what I'm saying? So the guy, we got to get off this social media and start paying attention to the shit that's 
right in front of right our face and shit you. that yeah. kid yeah. like Ronnie mm -hmm. that dropped Thanks. a 115. I don't mm -hmm. know that nigga. 20 years in the game. 20 years yeah. in the game. 20 years in veteran. the game. Season veteran. Never crashed a whip. Yeah. I don't, I don't yeah. know Get you from A to B. Impeccable driving record. Impeccable yeah. driving record. Oh, and nice. he's to do it. Ronnie sound like Cool Ranch. Mm -hmm. No, he sound like Nacho Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> he's for sure Nacho Cheese. <laughs> y'all didn't answer if y'all would if y'all would wife somebody with no teeth. Mm. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I would. Yeah, I would. In a heartbeat, if the personality what, what, was yeah, cool, because what, because, what, yeah. what because, because what I'm yeah. looking because Veneers. because what I'm you looking could. for what I'm looking for honestly. You know, is a motherfucker that's gonna be down. Cause like you how said, how you looking I, for I, something and somebody was just laying next to you? I'm no, gonna, like hypothetically. Hypothetically, yeah. see, you yeah. going? Yeah. You going? You all smug shit. You all smug shit. I told you, girl, you too pretty. All that hate don't look good on you. That hate is not becoming of you, Jim. I'm done. I'm, I'm just done. saying, baby, you a beautiful young lady and shit. Got I'm everything done. Going you for just yourself. wasn't about to skip past that, but continue. Go ahead. Go I'm ahead. just saying, though, you know, you just got to go for the shit that's, you know, that's good for you in the end. Okay. Yeah. But Vic wants to know which tooth was missing. Yeah, what tooth would like what the front tooth? The front tooth. Oh, like like the girl, uh, like Krishan. Yeah, I'm with it. I'm with it. She don't look too bad, but she got a tooth. Sometimes it add character. No, yeah, it added character to her for sure. That was like you're fucking capping. You're capping right now. You're capping. No, I would date Krishan. I would date Krishan. You would date Krishan. That's somebody who's been on a reality show who has a lot of followers. She's actually really, really gorgeous. And missing a tooth, and I don't discriminate. We don't it's discriminate. We go into between, it. It's different between date and fuck, though, too. Let's keep that clear. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. facts. It's different between date and fuck. We're, yeah. not, we're not using the and term even date. even if it's a really pretty girl, but like like missing like a back tooth back here, like so, a molar. Like so, y'all would date yeah. somebody you're not attracted to. No, no. I mean, uh -huh. you still could be attracted to them. Yeah. Just missing the tooth. It's just no, the I said somebody you're not attracted to because the teeth will make you un unattracted See, no, I to me. No, no, I would not date nobody I'm not attracted to. But I'm fuck the dog shit out the bitch if nobody knew. <laughs> like, if I can keep it quiet, you know what I'm saying? Like, nobody gonna find out. Then fuck it. Yo, that's what that's that's what you think. And then one day, and then one day she opens her mouth, and then now people are like you you hit that. And it's like. Yeah, I thought nobody was gonna find out. Right? I ain't tripping. I'm missing some. It's all good, baby. We put them together. We'll have a whole set. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all was some bullshit. No jumper. This is no yeah, jumper. Mad right. lately, right now. And I'm Slink Johnson, yeah. the carnivorous coochie cutter in the house with Gina Views, <laughs> Rosecrans, Vic, and my man Gabe. We're kicking it mm -hmm. live in the place to be right now. Hit us up on the chat line. Is we we live? I don't even see the chat room. If y'all in the chat room, hit my shit. Dollar sign Slink Johnson. Yep. Love me down right now because yep. every dollar, every every donation you send, uh, dollar sign Slink Johnson goes to the help keep Tasha's baby daddy out of prison <laughs> foundation. And you do know that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Every every donation yeah. prevents one unsuspecting racist from being robbed and hit over the head at, at gunpoint. Yeah. So. Slink. Dollar sign Slink Johnson. Slink, real quick, what uh, can you explain what the whole Smoke Yours movement is, real quick, for the youth? Youth oh, out there. Oh, the Just youth, tapping in. Oh, man, Smoke Yours is more than just, you know, smoke your weed. Like, oh, here, uh, I want to smoke all your weed or some leech shit. Mm -hmm. Smoke Yours is, 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 is to do you. Yep. Whatever you is, do you. Smoke yeah. yours, ski yours, cook yours. Uh, yeah. Meth, smoke Whatever. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. That's what you whatever do, man. Whatever, whatever you do. do you. Yeah. Whatever you, know what you if your heart desires it. Yeah, I didn't say meth. I mean, <laughs> that's a little extreme. I mean, if that's what you, but if that's what you <laughs> if that's like. that's what you do. And you're not hurting nobody. Smoke <laughs> yours, bro. I'm not tripping. Yeah. But smoke yours is to do you, and it's it's, a, it's also a friendship uh a organization based on friendship through cannabis. I ain't mm -hmm. got none. Smoke some of yours. Yeah. Like J Money, smoke yeah. his. And, and then um and that don't mean I won't smoke mine, because if I'm here and I got weed, if I'm smoking, I'm smoking. We all smoking. If you smoke, yeah. we're gonna hit that shit. Yeah. Just smoke that. It don't matter. Somebody need to light that shit. Mm -hmm. We don't do match. Yeah. We don't do match. Yeah. We do smoke yours. You Come got on. some, smoke it. I got some, smoke it. J Money, twist yeah. some more up. So, anyways, so, yeah. um, my homie J Mac, right? Playmaker mm -hmm. John, he mm -hmm. knew he knew exactly what your movement was all about. He knew that all three of us don't fucking smoke so he wanted to give this pack to you oh okay. yeah playmaker john you can tell he's filipino by the sun the filipino sun <laughs> play Mac, yeah playmaker, playmaker john playmaker john man yeah. thank you so much for this weed i really Here's appreciate some joints it. if you want to roll up too oh thank yeah. you oh, man there you go. Yeah. john you all right with me man i really <laughs> fuck with you i don't care what this nigga gabe said about you <laughs> <laughs> look here, bro. I, look here. I, all you got to do is stop by the drugstore, get the little cream, put it on there like three days, it'll be clear, bro. I ain't even tripping. 
I'm not even tripping, bro. I fuck with you, Playmaker John. Thank you, man. Smoke yours. And he watches Black Jesus on Adult Swim, and then he was like, I know what type of person he is. He smokes indica. Do you smoke indica? Do you like indica? John fucking right. John, you <laughs> fuck with me, John. John fucking right. That's I, I like John. I yeah. like John better than I like you, nigga. Oh, shit. John is all right, man. <laughs> fucking John, I hate you, bro. Why didn't you Why didn't you bring John in your place today? Ooh, John got some funky too. Look, he, look at this. Punch in on this. You can't punch in on what well, we lie. But look, this is this shit, nigga. Show it to him. Show it to him. <laughs> hey, which camera are you at, J-O? J-Money, what camera are we at? <laughs> Shout out to me, J-Mac, man. Jonathan. Jesus, bro. I just dropped a bud. I can't be dropping buzz and shit. <laughs> hey, John, you all right with me, though, John? <laughs> Put it back, Gina. Put it back. <laughs> I know your little thieving fingers and shit. Gina type is still a nigga. She don't smoke. She'll take a nigga weed and give it to the nigga she like. Right, Here, Dante. Fuck that. Fuck Dante. Oh, shit. That does sound like something Gina would do for sure. Boy, Dante. Boy fuck you. <laughs> I like how she said that. Boy, fuck you. That was real. That was real. That was real. What's up, though? We finna smoke. Wait, some you want the shit. joints or I got some raps from the homie Desi G? He has his own raps. Give me some raps. In the back, but mm. like some uh, leaf. Yeah, you want some leaf, frontal leaf? Leaf me. Ah, uh, yeah. So leaf me. You I got like everything right tonight. What's this yeah. I also got shrooms. If you want shrooms, yeah, shoot them. <laughs> No hesitation. No, bro. This podcast. Wait, mushrooms, not shrooms. Give me the mushroom, (laughs) nigga. I'm going to pop the mushroom live on the 20th show. Nigga, give me the goddamn mushroom. You motherfuckers be talking to me like I'm a young ass punk. Here's some shrooms. Take take a handful. Whatever you want to eat. Whatever you want to eat. Oh, my God. You going to take all that for real? You want a cap? Oh, J.O. wants a cap. No, no, no. Don't take more than a cap. Okay. You got to eat them. <laughs> oh, shit. You got to eat them. Those are blue meat. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Holy shit. Holy shit. I didn't think you were really going to eat them, but you ate them. Oh, damn. I don't think about these motherfuckers are now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you really oh, taking the shrooms. Holy shit. Hold on. I got to find the wraps for you. Hold on. I got the wraps somewhere in here. <laughs> everything, everything, all the drugs I have is from the ground up. So nothing, you know what I mean? <laughs> so I got no prescription pills. How many drugs yeah. you have in their game? <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Hold on, I got the raps. I got the raps. We live on no jumper, you, mad lately, oh, bitch. Okay. Hey, I feel like I need to take some with you, bro. Yo, like, I can't, what yeah. else? You, what else you got in there, Gabe? You no. got some, you got some gorilla glue in there? Everything is organic. Don't panic. <laughs> Hold on, fucking strong me now. My, what we used to do, we put the motherfuckers in a blender with some uh, orange juice and yeah. some peanut butter and make a smoothie out the motherfuckers. He's talking about peanut butter, yeah. That's. Yeah. Why you acting scared now? <laughs> Don't be acting scared now. You talking shit a minute ago. Oh no, my God, they're doing rap. drugs. This is from the homie Desi G. He got his own brand. It's called The Pack. It's a big frontal leaf. Gabe C sponsored Desi by everybody. G. Yeah, come on, Desi. Desi. Yeah, my boy Desi G. Yeah. Desi, y'all hit y'all, y'all cannabis sponsors hit me up, man. You see, I ain't got no cannabis sponsorship. I need a motherfucking strain. Bro, I'm fucking, I'm gonna take some with you, bro. Yeah, why you wanna take mine? You got a big ass bag. Take the ones I cherish, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> You about to take that Sleep. home with you? <laughs> Jay Money, you all right with me, man? Fuck. No jumper. That's right. He In East LA, they say no yumper. <laughs> I'm gonna take some with you. How much you take? You take a grip? I took a cap and a stem, man. I'm gonna okay. take some more. About ten minutes. If I, uh, if I take I the stem with like, you. I take the stem with you. If I don't feel my shit blasting off. I'm going to take some more. Because my car never rosity bubbling, though. I feel the hey, engine take, revving, nigga. Take one more step with me. Is that cool? All right, come on, nigga. Let's go. Cheers. Jesus oh, you, want, you want mine? Here, take mine. I'll take it from the back. You this have to show take has home. Gone off the rails. It's the 20th episode. We got to do it, Vic. Hey, fuck it. He was going to take it on live. I wasn't going to take it live, but since he took it live, we taking it live. I just want to see what the chat's saying right now. <laughs> let's, let's let Sling talk to the chat before we leave. Oh yeah, for oh, sure. Oh yeah, later on, yeah. Um, I'm taking it with you. Hold did, on. Okay, yeah. Nigga, I on. took it. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't even cheers. You just took the shit. Nigga, we cheered. Nigga, I'm cheerful as a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> cheers, nigga. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 
I'm eating that's why I eat. <laughs> Gabe C. Take a cap, baby. No way. Hey, I'm come to take a nah. cap. Mm -mm. You acting like a little bitch right now. <laughs> Hit the cap, nigga. Give this to Big J.O. J.O., can you take this Hit, to the cap? You acting like a little bitch right now. Them niggas smoked your cousin, nigga. And you ain't gonna do nothing about it, nigga. You better take that cap, nigga. Can you pass this to J.O.? J. Money? Oh, my God. This little pussy ass shit right here. This look like a button on a baby coat. This shit is nothing, man. What the fuck is this? I think he disrespecting your manhood with that small ass cap, nigga. Now you should have saw the one he took earlier. Yeah, he, he took did, a big he, one yeah, earlier. He, yeah. Why is you monitoring that nigga tolerance? <laughs> you see him shit. You good, right? He eating, he eating his Doritos. J.O., shit. do you want more? Yeah, that nigga want more. No. All right. Here, let me hold his. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, it's about Man. that time. I'm feeling good. <laughs> yeah, this is. I this. really didn't think you were gonna do it live. Man. That's how you know a nigga old nigga. We be uh, stretching this motherfucking. Vibe. I'm feeling good. <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> This, yeah, this is the this is the funnest uh, national side chick day I've ever had. Mm -hmm. To be honest. No. Nope. Hey yeah. man, I don't I don't believe in side chicks. What do you believe in? They are my girlfriend. Mm. I'm in a relationship with all my bitches. Yeah, yeah I mean, future verse thirty seven, <laughs> verse, they verse seven. They provide different things. You know what I'm saying? They, yeah. they, they're, 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 you know, they're different. They're all my girlfriends. I don't like to make them like, you know, titles and them. So girl. they're all nacho cheese Doritos. Yep, all yep. of them. Some well, of, you, some you of gotta be, explain. You gotta explain some, the. Some um, of them might be that sweet spicy nacho. Okay. That shit is good as a motherfucker too. <laughs> A new challenger has entered the chat. <laughs> Gina, Gina, can nacho. you explain the the nacho cheese versus the uh, Cool Ranch? I know what his answer gonna be, so, so I'm not gonna explain the whole thing. I mean, everybody, yeah. everybody shit on but, Cool Ranch, but I like Cool Ranch. <laughs> no, no there's, a, there's another explanation for it. There's another explanation so, for it. Gina, go all ahead. All right, so we was having a conversation about if you try to get at a girl and she curve you, is it okay for you to talk to her homegirl? I already know your answer. You fucking right. <laughs> You fucking right. So, if you if you and your friend go in the store, and you and your friend pick up this cup, and mm, I don't want it, and you like the cup, you you ain't supposed to get the cup because because she didn't like it because she picked it up first. <laughs> she didn't drink out the motherfucker. She just looked at it. And I don't want it. Yeah. So yeah, yeah you better. So That's what I'm so saying. when you yeah. open a variety pack of chips, which one do you get first? Mm. Where you gonna start at? They got a bunch of different kinds of variety. <laughs> the Dorito, basic one. The Dorito ones. The basic one. It oh. got it got it got nacho cheese, cool ranch, lays, Fritos. Maybe sweet and spicy. I think like nacho. Hot it depends on what I got going on with it. You know what I'm talking about? I'm like, <laughs> I might reach for the funions first. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I'm but if there's only funky, the, I want some funions. But if there's only two left, and it is Doritos, Cool Ranch, or spicy not or spicy not, nacho cheese. Which one are you gonna pick up? Be absolutely, absolutely honest. Real straight up shit. Literally, when them two brands, them two flavors, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't. I don't care. I don't. Cool Ranch, Nacho, whatever. I eat. I eat them with cottage cheese anyway. The shit tastes good. <laughs> cottage cheese. Cottage yeah. cheese. Cream Dorito, cheese. Doritos. No cottage cheese. Doritos and cottage cheese is bomb. What? Shout out to my cousin Shrimp Loke that put me up on that shit way back and way back when me and your mama was kicking it. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> I introduced your mama to the Ducata cheese and Doritos. She loved it. So can you uh, can you talk about the um, We Know Your Mama movement? Because you've been going hard with it recently. Yeah, yeah, Vic. You know, I just, you know, I... The, your, the 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 know your mama movement it it, it it come from a lot of places you know what I'm talking mm -hmm. about it, it it come from a lot of places you know for one thing I want to make sure that I want people to understand that you know your mama human and I think we need to give mamas their humanity back you know what I'm talking about we hold mama up to this on this pedestal where as we should because she mama but we forget that you know mama human you know mama you know mama like cool ranch doritos too <laughs> you know what i'm talking about mama mama want to have some fun mama want that little trim tickle sometimes you know what i'm saying and it's all good and you know being up in age now you know i was just talking to you cast you know i ain't finna go into the you know niggas ages but you know you was telling me like damn when y'all like damn i was really grown y'all can i probably know your mama <laughs> Wait, where where did you grow up? Uh, Inglewood, South LA, and YA. You damn, my did. mom used to work at Inglewood. Fuck, yo, my <laughs> my, my, my mama grew up in Inglewood, <laughs> Lennox. <laughs> Don't look at it. Slick, like how that. you know my mama? <laughs> 
<laughs> and the whole thing is, look, when I know your mama, that don't mean I had sex with your mama. That did not mean that. I just said I know your mama. I remember when she was young, she had a little ponytail inside, and she used to wear the scrunch socks and shit, uh, the two pairs of scrunch socks up high. Your legs be real shiny because she couldn't afford the good lotion, so she used Vaseline. I remember that. I remember your mama. You know what I'm talking about? I wasn't fucking her, but the homie was. But that's something else. <laughs> That's something else. Let me get a lighter. <laughs> I know these niggas' checking. mamas, man. <laughs> niggas gotta humble themselves. And also, also knowing these niggas' mamas, I need niggas to understand that, you know, I got three daughters. I got three daughters. I got a mama. I got two sisters, three sisters. You know what I'm saying? I love them all. You know what I'm saying? And I respect them all. Niggas gotta start respecting these women and quit. Dealing with these women and talking to them and treating them like you do because if not, one day somebody gonna have a know your mama story for your daughter. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Or mm. your sister or your mama. So you know what I'm saying? Start it start with us. Let's start just treating these women, you know what I'm saying, with a little more respect. Cause you know, black men don't cheat. Black men, you know what I'm saying? We just try to just live and uphold, you know, the word like we supposed to, you know what I'm saying? So mm-hmm. I'm just saying, let's try to get to that more. Oh, okay. Word. That's Gina, have you ever been a side chick? Shit, I don't know. Not that you know of? Mm-mm. Not I wouldn't if, doubt it. Not if you was mine. <laughs> <laughs> look, look, look at me. <laughs> I, I think everybody been somebody's side piece. Oh, shit. On pur- like, would you be one on purpose, though? No. No? Mm-hmm. On, like, today? Or, like, what about in the past? Would I have been one on purpose in the past? Mm-hmm. No. no. I, I was a side piece and didn't even know it. Mm. I was funding the whole good time and didn't even know I was a side piece. Yeah, sometimes you don't, you're not really aware of it. Not really. Well, you're just having fun. You're just blissful. Yeah. You're just blissful as a motherfucker, just gleeful. You know what I'm talking about? Touching that little trim, smelling that little fragrant aroma. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? That trim on your mustache. You get up in the morning like, oh, I love that bitch. You, you, you usually... <laughs> You usually find out if you decide peace on their birthday, if yeah. they go to jail, or Valentine's Day. if they die. I found out I was a side piece on their birthday because bitch always get mad every year I, around the same time. Bitch, you what? What you <laughs> mad at me for? Oh, Picked bitch! A fight the day before. Yeah, you, oh, I see, bitch. Now niggas don't see the bitch patterns till after. Women are observant of everything that goes on in a relationship in real time. Understand that, my nigga. We don't see shit until way after the bitch gone and shit. Mm-hmm. Over, like, Yo. damn, that bitch was fucking with that nigga. Yes, yes, yes. nigga. <laughs> it took you. You can relate. Yeah. The yes. bitch done been through two niggas since then, and then you just now finding out. You, you just, know what I'm saying? You just start realizing she was only posting like the passenger seat of the car, like, and you're like, wait a minute. Like, you gotta learn what the inside of that car, her car, look like. Musty it's not ass that. chicken fish, bitch. <laughs> 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 Smoke yours. <laughs> Player J. J Money, he's behind you. Player John. <laughs> Play Michael John. Oh, shit. Smoke yours, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, did you guys see uh, Meek Mill and uh, Takashi, um, their little <laughs> scuffle? <laughs> I'm tired man, of Man, I'm nigga. so tired of all them <laughs> niggas. Meek, I like you. I've been through a love-hate thing with Meek. Like, I like, like I didn't like the nigga. I like the nigga. I like the nigga. I like him. I really fuck with Meek. Meek, stop fucking entertaining that rat shit. The shit pissed me off. All that fucking back and forth. You got all these fucking bodyguards and shit. Look here. Niggas, line it up. I don't even want to do yeah. all that fucking talking. Hey, look, Big Biff, Big Joe, Big Barry, you go talk to their security and tell them we're going to line this shit up. Fuck all this talking, all this camera shit. Y'all niggas stop doing this mm. shit with the camera. That's how niggas get killed. You mm. niggas really don't want to fight. You really don't want funk. But you put that camera in there, and then you get niggas all riled up, and then you get put in a position where you got to answer to that shit. Stop doing that shit. You niggas, not, niggas just hug, nigga. Just hug, nigga. You niggas don't want to do out. nothing. I'm tired of you niggas with this fucking... Niggas, be a wrestler or something. I'm tired of this shit, man. <laughs> Fake-ass shit, man. Niggas out here getting killed for real, and these rich-ass niggas is, 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 is bouncing, bouncing their naked-ass chests up against bodyguards and shit, trying to get to each other, knowing they really don't want to do nothing but make a record with each other. Stop that fag shit, nigga. And when I say fag, I mean most, most much respect to homosexuals, but you fag niggas... You know what I'm talking about. Stop that fag ass shit, nigga. 
Weird shit, man. I hate these old. That's that's why I need. I, I know your mama, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I know your mama. Hey, that's why you, your daddy didn't talk to these niggas, man. These niggas' daddies didn't talk to him, but I, I feel like it's my place because I know these niggas' mama, man. Stop. I'm going to tell you what your daddy should have told you, nigga. Enjoy that money. It's real niggas out here dying. A motherfucker with a bank account, a negative, negative zero. These niggas ain't got shit and dying on the street for some shit. And they can't get out of it. And y'all got everything ahead of you. Got everything for you, man. Stop. And, and you rappers, quit talking this weird ass nigga Takashi. He's a bitch and a troll. Stop talking to him. He's a fucking weirdo, man. Don't listen to that shit, man. Tired of these niggas, man. That's what I'm mad about. You motherfucking weirdos, man. This nigga got a motherfucking rainbow pompadour. You niggas is really gonna get mad at this nigga? Man, fuck this bitch ass nigga, man. We're talking to that guy, man. Fucking, you keep keep entertaining this fuck nigga shit, man. And 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 and, and stop all the bloggers as soon as they want to bring that bitch ass nigga up. He's a whore, man. Stop that shit, man. Just, the horosity has to stop, man. You guys is real, real, real timid, frigid little whores, and you got to stop, man, because it's some bullshit, and you're putting a black eye on the game, man. All this old weird <laughs> shit. And all you street niggas aligning yourself with these rich rappers just because you want to do something, nigga, you got to stop, man. Stop letting these niggas in the gate. These niggas ain't even did shit, nigga. These niggas is whores. But that's neither here. Now, I'm sweating this shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> nah, you who, who do you it. think came say out it. looking worse, though? Meek or Takashi? I hate to say it, but Meek. Meek, I like Meek, man, but Meek, come on, Meek, Meek, you cool, you fucking rich and hanging with, you know what I'm saying, you got the right bubble around you, don't fucking argue with this old rat, rats gonna get what they gonna get, one day that nigga gonna step on the glue trap and get stuck, my nigga, trust me when I tell you, stop, stop arguing with the weird ass nigga, man, stop giving these weird niggas motherfucking shine, stop, stop paying attention to this old buster ass shit, man, cause don't, none of these niggas wanna line it up, I'm not the toughest nigga in the world, man, but I'm telling you, I wanna line it up, I don't wanna do all that shit, we can jokey joke, and, and, and flip flop, and laugh, and ha ha ha, all that shit, man, but uh, hey nigga, when it get real, it get real, we gonna line it up, we not finna do all that old weird shit, man, stop. God damn, nigga got kids and shit looking, man. Come on, man. One day you're going to look at these motherfucking tapes 20 years from now, your kid's going to be looking like, damn, dad, you was a fucking clown. Stop, nigga. Fucking weirdos, nigga. Swear to God. Word. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not much else to add to that. <laughs> no, yeah, I think, I think Mink has come too far to be even entertaining 6 9 and doing some shit. Why are they in do? the same place, man? Look, yeah. man, line it up, nigga. I want to see the nigga squad. Fuck a rap battle. Fuck all this arguing in the parking lot. Fuck all the videos in these expensive condos, shirtless, with a gang of motherfucking guns dancing in the circle with 20 niggas. Fuck that shit, squad. Scrap, nigga. Mm -hmm. Have you seen this thing going on in um, South Central called Backyard Squabbles? Yeah. You seen that shit? Yep, I love it. I <laughs> love it. It's bringing it back. Shout out to my nigga. God bless his soul. Rest in peace, Big B. Big B from Rolling 20s yeah. NHB, my homeboy. That nigga showed me the fade tapes way back in the late 80s. Niggas been doing it, but they bringing it back. Yeah. You want to be a star? Mm-hmm. Go ahead and fat mouth now, nigga. Yeah, I just seen that. Backyard Squabbles. I think LA Taco did an um, article about it. They have a legit ring. They just have people lining it up. Tryouts. Like, it's legit as fuck. Mm -hmm. Like, they just have... What we need to do... Damn. We need to go down there and commentate. Do color commentary. If they win it, let's get it. That would be incredible. <clears throat> that reminds me of, like, Kimbo Slice era. Exactly. Remember the Kimbo yeah, Slice yeah, yeah. era? Yeah. I, I think not. We'll be like, from the top rope! I think I think not, because that's how niggas get killed. I think the backyard squabble should just be non-televised. Mm. I think they should just get theirs on, especially when it's real. Get theirs on, because motherfuckers don't need to see it. That's why niggas, I keep telling you, niggas is dying all the time, because it's getting caught on camera. And back in the days, niggas, could took, niggas took some beatdowns that... You had to be there to see, and if you wasn't there, that's cool, and they can live the rest of their life, mm -hmm. and uh, y'all didn't see that. But now, you know what I'm saying, everywhere you go, nigga, boy, dude, you the nigga that got fucked up. <laughs> yeah, now you got to kill a nigga. Yeah. Stop, man. Stop. Stop putting the, the camera ain't for everything, man. You, this generation, I love y'all niggas, man. This is your uncle, man. I know your mama, man. I'm telling you, I'm just trying to help you out. Stop putting everything on camera, my nigga. Everything don't deserve it. Even when it's non-criminal. Some tender moments with your family, with your bitch. That, the, 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 the world don't need to have that, man. It ain't for them. It's for you. You know what I'm saying? Stop doing that shit, man. I swear to God, man. I wish... Tell your mom to call me. <laughs> 310. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, oh, I, I'm gonna yeah. do it off camera. Okay. <laughs> five, five, five. <laughs> I'm talking to the show taking a dud. I'm sorry. I don't want to do that. You know what I'm saying? I just get passionate about seeing these youngsters doing some stupid goofball shit, man. Stop, nigga. Stop. Meek Mill is rich. Stop arguing with this weird old man. He's still nigga gasping for air, man. He's a snitch, man. The streets don't love him, and he gonna do whatever Hollywood gonna do. He gonna do whatever Hollywood let him do to keep afloat. He can't come back to the streets. He's a snitch. He's a whore. The nigga's a bitch. He can't come back to the street, man. So, you know, he gonna do all kinds of clown shit. Don't subject yourself with that clown shit with that nigga, man. He's a buster, man. What that nigga Nip say, man? We don't entertain clowns, man. Come on, man. Rest in peace, Nip Hustle, yep, man. Yep. Weird ass niggas out here, man. Yeah. Speaking of Nipsey, did you hear the, the track he did with uh with Jay-Z? No, I didn't hear it yet. Bruh, that shit is so it's hard. Fire. That shit is so hard, man. With Jay-Z, that's the feature that we wanted forever, man. And it was like such a powerful record. It's a, it, that that beat itself. Um, I don't know if Hit Boy uh, produced it. No, or no, 15, that was fifteen hundred. Oh, was that was that fifteen hundred? That was a uh, fifteen hundred. Mike and Key, oh, bro. My guy Mars. I tried to do a versus battle. I hit that nigga Jay Z. He didn't hit me back. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga don't want to see me. He don't want to see me. I want a versus battle. Jay Z, y'all spam that nigga Jay Z right now. Wherever he on right yeah. now, you spam that nigga and tell that nigga to get Slink Johnson his motherfucking versus battle. Tell mm -hmm. <laughs> Nigga ain't got no hits. <laughs> bro, you ain't even last the first round. Nigga ain't got round. no hits. <laughs> you ain't gonna last the first round, bro. I'm fucking with you, Jigga. He gonna play Can I Get Up? What you gonna play? He got some shit with Too Short probably in the tuck. <laughs> I got some shit. I, I mean, you know, it's hits for me. The, the rest of the world, you know, didn't quite get it yet. However, <laughs> you'll get a bar. You know what I'm saying? Check this out, man. I'm a barbarian, man. I do all this shit, man. I rap. You know, act, co comedy, you know, change, breaks, babysit, all kinds of shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Seminars, life coach, all kinds of Grand shit. Grand Theft Auto 5? Yep. GTA 5, nigga, yeah. Yeah, uh, speak about that, like how that came about and just the phenomenon of like Lamar Davis and how it's taken like a life of its own. Well, that nigga DJ Pool, shout out to my main man DJ Pool. That's live. a solid nigga. Yeah. I love DJ Pool. Let me give that man his motherfucking mm -hmm. roses. Cause DJ Pool changed a lot of niggas' lives, yeah. man. But DJ Pool uh, gave me the call. He asked me to come out and read for the part. Nigga did it, knocked it out the pin arc, and here you go. You know what I'm saying? That motherfucker made a billion dollars, and I got half a tank of gas right now. Rockstar, hit a nigga, man. <laughs> I'm just saying, man. <laughs> I remember um, seeing one of your interviews, and you, you said after the first take, after you left that audition, you already knew you had it. Mm -hmm. Cause I was hungry. <laughs> I'm still hungry. Can't you feel the hunger? Yeah, Can't I you feel right it. now? You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? I was just gnawing that Gina elbow a minute ago because it smelled <laughs> like vanilla. Nigga, hungry and shit. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I was, niggas oh, hungry, shit. man. Nigga want that shit, man. You know what I'm talking about? You, if you want it, nigga, you got to be hungry. That don't mm -hmm. mean act a goddamn fool. That means stretch yourself to the limits of yourself and be the best version of yourself and get that shit. Like a you slinky. Like a fucking slinky. But I'm only fun for the girls. I don't fuck with the boys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only fun for the girls, nigga. <laughs> All you niggas that had right on, nigga. Get on, nigga. <laughs> You niggas don't smell like vanilla, nigga. And for you niggas that do smell like vanilla, go like, that I smell way. like vanilla. I fucking smell like vanilla. <laughs> this shroom cast is on some other shroom shit. Cast. I think it's low key get hidden right now. Not gonna lie. I actually, hey, right there. Go I'm, ahead. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna take some more because actually, I just feel my my carnivorosity is idling yeah. at about Chill 27. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, 2,700 RPMs. I still can go up a little higher. Yeah. <laughs> you want to keep that for the to-go and, and it go, uh, go out of the bag? We're going to get that for to now. I need some more <laughs> water. To now. Okay, to now. We're going to get it in a second. Hold on, hold on, man. Yeah, I know yeah. what I'm doing. I know what I'm I doing, I'll get you some water. I got hold you on, some just water. chill out. Just relax, Gabe. You said one, we you gonna, just wanted water. I'm going to get you water. We're going to get one of the guys got off the camera, man. You got oh, okay. a whole fucking staff. No jumper is a motherfucking illustrious business here. <laughs> it's a lot of shit going on behind the scenes. You don't know. You got runners and shit, all kinds of shit. Naked bitches at the dope greeting me and shit. It was a naked, yeah. naked ramp, bitch ramp, gave me a COVID test. Ramp? <laughs> naked bitch You're gave me a COVID test. <laughs> she just straight tested a nigga. All up in your Naked nose. as a motherfucker. <laughs> I'm trying to look at you. <laughs> 
<laughs> hey, that sounds like a new. That sounds like a new business. Naked COVID test. Mm. Yeah, I get tested Like the lady twice a comes week. out. And <laughs> yeah. Naked as a motherfucker. <laughs> what? <laughs> you get the whole Sam's Huff, bro. <laughs> yeah, they should it's, open that yeah. up as a COVID test center. <laughs> I just came back from Atlanta, and yeah. that motherfucker. Thank, thank you, you very much. Thank See, you. I'm talking about. No jumper is a real motherfucking business. You see the white man coming here with the motherfucking water? <laughs> a white man did that. This is real business, nigga. You see that shit? Don't you like getting served by a white man? Shit? He served me the frosty with his shit. Thank you, white man. It's about motherfucking time. He served me some frosty ass water. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's right, nigga. He know what's happening. He seen that hat. <laughs> nigga, shout out to Straw and Wool, man. Straw yeah. and Wool, they keep me right. But you see this hat, nigga? Yeah. You like this? So mm -hmm. That's the cool. Caden, man. That's the Caden, K A D E N, yeah. man. You know what I'm talking about? It's available at strawandwool.com, man. Get you one of these. Yeah. Use my promo code yeah, Slink10. Yeah, Slink10. Slink10. <laughs> Slink Slink S L N I K. S L I N K. See, this room's fucking with you. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> but let me ask you a question. Can I pull one of those off? Hmm? You think I could pull one of those off? Yeah, I'm sure you can. You think so? I'm sure you can. Cause I, you know what? I see, I see pimping in you. Ooh, I see it in you. Is you it just, in me? You, it on me. It's though. in you. You just ain't tapped into it yet. Mm. You just say you gotta get the you gotta hey you gotta quit you gotta fuck with the fifty dollar haircuts. You got you, you gotta stop got, beefing with your barber, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. Hey, but hey, that nigga doing you wrong, bro. Yeah. So what would a real pimp do for a haircut? Because the perm, wait, 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 perm first looks all, like a three hundred dollar haircut. I don't know what a real pimp would do. I don't know what a real pimp would do. I don't know because I'm I'm not a pimp. I'm not a pimp. Okay. I am a, I'm a slap. Okay, slap. Something like a pimp. Almost. <laughs> I'm just not. I just ain't. I just ain't got all my my certifications yet. I can't. I can't. The troops in it. You're just on point right now. I don't want you to know what the fuck is happening. A slap? Mm hmm. Hmm. I went to school for that shit, man. I went to school. I, uh, I was in Mozambique, man. I, man, I've been around the world, man. Master <laughs> of the West African Monkey Spank Technique, yeah. five-time Wild Cheetah Submission Hole Champion, yeah. the Prime Minister of Pound Down, mm -hmm. founder and president of the Smoke Yours Crew, yeah. your mama's favorite. I got a lot of monikers, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I've been doing it, you know? Well, teach you how to uh, fish 5,000 5, fishes? Or what was it? What'd you say on the show? I teach you how to... Uh Fish 5,000 fishes. I be popping so much shit, I don't know. I got to go back in the archives. <laughs> Teach 5,000 fishes. I got to go in the archives. You know, nigga be popping shit. Yeah. <laughs> Just being black Jesus alone is like yeah. the biggest flex you can really be. Like, yeah. how is that that... I'm, I'm sure people come up to you and probably call you that. Like, Yeah, they come up to me at all the wrong times because I, you know... I still be trying to shoplift and shit. Don't be, don't, <laughs> don't come up to me while I'm stealing, my nigga. Wait, catch me in the parking lot. If we in the store, you don't know what I'm doing. Come on, man, talk to me in the parking Dine lot. Dining dash, all that, yeah, bro. Man, niggas gonna yeah. stop me and shit. I got a motherfucking coat full Black of shrimp. Black Jesus, man, come on, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm trying to make this shit disappear. <laughs> He's trying to turn water into wine. <laughs> At CVS. Like. <laughs> nah, but it's amazing though, man. It's definitely, you know what? Honestly, I'm overwhelmed and I'm humbled by it all, man, for motherfuckers. Because again, in this fast-paced world, there's so much going on. So many vibrant things uh, here and there and so much other shit to, to take your attention, man. It's, it's, it's nice that a motherfucker will come to you and, and you mm. know, Tell you, you know, express that they really fuck with what you do, man. I appreciate it, man. That's love, man. That's that. Especially, you know, most of my demographic, most of my fan base is made up of men. You know what I'm saying? So, I get a lot of dudes come to me, and I really appreciate that because, you know, being dudes, we homophobic a lot of times. We, it's hard to tell another nigga, damn, you tight or that shit was good. But when they do, I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Because, man, niggas don't be wanting to. But I appreciate it when they do, man. That's love. Thank you. Yeah, and so that nigga high as yeah. just, <laughs> that nigga high as giraffe pussy like on the seven forty seven right Jesus. now. He high as a like Jesus. I was never supposed to take shrooms live on stream, but since Black Jesus wanted to do it, and he's still taking them. Yeah, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> what? You just took a host. That was a point five. You took a point five to the dome. Is that right? <laughs> That's a whole gram. You got down to take the last one. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah. He's down to take the last one. I'll refill it. Don't worry. 
Oh shit! <laughs> Y'all are on some he nuts took shit. a whole Look eighth. At Gina's face. He took a whole eighth. Wait, for the people at home, you guys don't understand. What? <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker, nasty as fuck. <laughs> Black Jesus just has an incredible is, tolerance for, oh, for drugs. Like. I, I just want to chill with you for the next eight hours because that I know that's gonna last you twelve hours. I mean, you're gonna be on your ass for the next eight hours, so I might as well find yeah. somebody to kick yeah. it with. We gonna be in the parking lot just staring at stars. This <laughs> <laughs> is gonna be putting me on. Oh shit! All right, so um, Slink, real quick. Um, I know Jesus. you said you you celebrated your birthday, right? And you're feeling a little older, but you finally took a gas station pill. Yeah. That you know that's that's Vic's shit. The oh yeah. Rhinos? I'm sponsored by Rhino. Oh, oh right on, man. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god. Right on. <laughs> <laughs> How was your first experience? It was a, it was all right, man. But niggas, you know, just, the night didn't go as planned. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, just... the, I know the Rhino work. Nigga went through a whole a whole bottle of lotion, but yeah, the motherfucker worked. <laughs> Did, did you get the headache after? No, no, no. Oh, okay, okay, that's good. Yeah, that's the that's the premium. You got the premium. He, he splurged. <laughs> I used the other one. You know they got all the motherfucking animals and shit. I think I use motherfucking cheetah. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen a the, cheetah. The cheetah Wait, submission hole. <laughs> the only thing I've seen is the rhinos. I don't know where the fuck you're going. Where nah, did you I see seen the somebody cheetah? Posted kangaroo yesterday. Oh, they kangaroo? Had a kangaroo? Yeah, they I seen that see yesterday. That shit. What? You you a little nigga, man. I'm trying to tell you, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Y'all little niggas stop taking them gas station pills. Save them for the niggas the older homies, man. <laughs> Y'all niggas ain't going to be no good keep taking them gas niggas 24 years old off gas station pills and perks, man. Y'all need to stop this shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you dropping gems tonight. I'm holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> Only stop this shit. Your dick and your back is good, nigga. Stop. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, nigga? You young, nigga. Stop taking all them drugs. Same for the niggas, you know what I'm saying? The bus drivers like like Ron. <laughs> like Ronnie. <laughs> like Ronnie. <laughs> cool, nigga. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you got low T, you know what I'm talking about, nigga? <laughs> low testosterone. <laughs> Oh my god What's up Gina You good baby She's speechless right you, now you, 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 you see it You see this macking You can see it live in color huh? You see it <laughs> <laughs> Look look she just is, <laughs> She high too She took shit <laughs> So Slink um, Black Jesus started out originally On the Super Rumble Mix show Yeah <laughs> 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 so, <laughs> tell us what the, the Super Rumble Mix Show was, how it started, like. That nigga high as a motherfucker. I'm about to start laughing. All right, so when I start, I'm going to pop shrooms. Laugh. Hold on, when I pop shrooms, my homies always tell me that I laugh like a baby dolphin. So, mm -hmm. if you hear a baby dolphin throughout the show, it's because I'm smacked off the shrooms. But continue, I'm Call sorry. Call that nigga Flipper. <laughs> Now, Super Rumble Mix Show, man, was is a variety show, man. You know, created by Aaron Magruder. There's a bunch of different segments in the Super Rumble Mix Show, like Black Jesus, like uh, uh, Ask John Witherspoon, Negro News Network, mm -hmm. and Tube Steak. You know what I'm saying? Bunch of bunch of great sketches and segments. You know what I mean? More water. Here we go. <laughs> come here, come here, come here. <laughs> 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 say what's up, Yuri. Say what's up. Come on. They just did a whole handshake. Yeah. <laughs> I fuck with you, white man. <laughs> <laughs> what's that white man name? Yuri. 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 Oh, he a real white man. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga's a real. He comes straight from the homeland of white man. That nigga named Yuri. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> That's why he's so goddamn good, huh? He just got out here. <laughs> that nigga visa about to expire. He... <laughs> yeah. So uh, it started off as a Super Rumble show. Then at what point did it pick up into like the um, the like pilot of, that we see? Adult Swim. I was about six swim. years in between. Mm -hmm. wow. It was like, it was about six years, man. I think uh, Super Rumble was like two thousand eight. Oh, okay, and okay. Jesus made his debut on TV in 2014. I think we shot the the pilot in 2013, mm. 
and came back and we got greenlit and then shit. In 2014, we shot and the motherfucker came out on yeah. TV. Yeah. And mm-hmm. we're what? Seven. Four seasons in? Three, three, three. three. Hmm. Is Wait. there going to be a fourth? I don't know. I was, Yuri. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you remember where you were when you got that call then? Because I know that call had to change your life. When I, got, when I got. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to ask the white man, you know. I don't know if the show coming back. You got to ask the white man. You know? uh, I'm going to say yeah, but the white man only know that. You know what I'm oh, but uh, where was I when I got the yeah. call? Um, man, I was, I was shooting GTA 5. Oh, shit. I was in New York and... I remember getting a call. I think I—I I don't know if I called him back or whatever, because I know we was in and out the studio shooting, uh, you know, shooting the motion capture. And I just remember I was happy as a motherfucker. I went back solo, nigga. They green lit us, nigga. We Damn. Old, nigga. I'm black Jesus. That had to be a crazy ass month for you because first of all, you're on GTA Five, and then you get a call from Cartoon Network like we want to give you a show. Mm-hmm. That's, That's a blessing, stuff. man. It's God, That's man. It's crazy. only God, man. Yeah. God, yeah. God making his movements, man. And, he, and, I, and I, I love him and appreciate him for every move he make. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. How did you deal with, like, I'm sure there was some type of backlash for you portraying Jesus like, like that. What, like, what, what was your, like, response to it? Only backlash I got was bitches like, no, snake, I'm not going to suck your dick with that wig on. You got to take it off. <laughs> like, bitch, I'm Jesus. <laughs> Bitch, let me bless you. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I didn't get no backlash. I mean, <laughs> I mean, it was a lot of shit in the press, but you know, personally, I didn't, no, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't get no backlash. Yeah. No, I, I fucked with the show. I, I thought it was, you know, hilarious. And just the fact that they, you, even though it was like outlandish and shit, it was still like you still always kind of brought it home to like a yeah. central theme, mm-hmm. you know what oh, I mean? Yeah. That was like pushing a positive message, which was pretty yeah. funny. Oh yeah, and that's much respect to Aaron Magruder. You know what yeah. I'm saying? It was important to him that we kept that, you know, kept that wholesomeness. You know, G, you know, Jesus' ultimate divinity. We wanted to keep that intact. You know what I'm saying? We didn't mm-hmm. want to put a black eye on that, and I appreciate. Because leave it to me, I probably would have really, really niggerized Jesus. <laughs> But I'm, I'm glad that, you know, that was a smart move. I mean, I'm, I'm going to give that to Aaron. You know, again, I agree with it. it it's, it's dope, you know, because it gives more substance and depth to the show, you know, when somebody can get something out of it. And that means a whole lot to me, too. You know, when you can get something out of it, you like the show, my nigga, you fuck with it, and like, damn, my nigga, that really... I, I can't tell you how many uh, messages I get from people that say, like, you know, shit helped me at a, at a low point in my life, and it really make it really make me feel some kind of way, you know. It, it yeah. Feel like purpose, my nigga. Yeah, I would like to believe that Jesus is that way, like somewhat. Like yeah. how you were like, I'm not real. gonna do a miracle right now, bro. Leave me alone. Like <laughs> it's up, it's up to pops. Yeah, it's up I, to I think pops. So. I, I quote Pac. Pac. Pac said, "They say Jesus is a kind man that he should understand times in this crime land." Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, what that mean to me? The way I interpret it is, you know, he understands what's going on. Jesus is not going to judge you. You know, God is going to, he's the mm-hmm. ultimate judge, but Jesus is not going to judge you. I'm just going to love you. You know, I know shit fucked up out here. I don't, I don't think you need to, you shouldn't do it like that, but I'm not going to judge you for it, and I'm going to love you regardless. You know what I'm saying? Jesus is with you everywhere. Jesus is in the car with that drive-by. He don't want you to do it. Like, Chill, and that's you know when they turn around, that's when they get that change of heart. Sometimes niggas don't listen; they still go. Jesus is with you when you in there stealing. Jesus mm-hmm. is with you when you in jail. Yeah. Jesus is with you at all these low points, just like he is with your high points. So when you recognize and acknowledge this, Jesus is always with you. You might change your behavior, or you might give more thought to your behavior. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Knowing you got somebody with you, no need to be scared, no need to be fearful. Don't be fearful. You ain't got to be out here acting like this. I'm with you. You did. Yeah, I got you, my nigga. Mm-hmm. You think Jesus was with you when you were allegedly um, sticking people for their cars? Absolutely, absolutely, I, absolutely. I think he was with me when I was allegedly uh, <laughs> doing such things. <laughs> Who did you say you played for the the uh, Inglewood? I played, yeah, I played left pistol for the Inglewood carjackers. <laughs> Left pistol. Left pistol. Yeah, I went nineteen and one. 
That's a streak. That's a streak. That one oh, took me yeah. out the game. <laughs> <laughs> how much? Uh, how much time did you do? Um, I gave the state of California uh, thirty-one months. Oh shit! Yeah, that's a sentence for sure. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. And when you came out, is that when you pursued your rap career, or how did how did that work? Yep, yep, yep. I was young, and I went in young and CYA, and then you know I always was rapping. I always had a knack for putting words together, and you know what I'm saying. But when I got out, my seeing my friends, they was doing, they was actually making tapes and shit. That blew my mind. Like nigga, where you do that at? I thought you had to have a whole deal, but you know, niggas had studio access and shit. You're right. And we started doing it, and I just started taking it more seriously, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I started back in 86, been going hard since 94, a veteran and a time. In the dark, you see my diamonds glow. You know what I'm talking about? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got them on right now, because these niggas, just, that's just rapper talk. <laughs> rappers, rappers be wishing diamonds, you know what I'm saying? And y'all rappers, man, y'all stop wearing that bullshit, man. It's a lot of you niggas wearing some bullshit, man. Just don't wear nothing. If you can't get some real shit, don't wear bullshit, man. I see you niggas with these fugazi-ass stones and shit. And people be popping out with diamond testers now, so you don't want to do that. Yeah, y'all niggas watch out. <laughs> I'm telling you. And that shit, that make it bad for the niggas out here jacking, man. Nigga, niggas go to jail for life. You don't want a nigga to go to jail for life for a fake ass chain. At least make it worth some. I got it, baby. It's cool. It's cool. I see a real nigga going to fix it. You see what I'm saying? I see you an independent black woman. You know what I'm talking about? And you trying to make sure it go right. But fear not, baby. A real nigga's here. You understand what I'm talking about? I hear you. How you like your eggs? Fried and fertilized. <laughs> see, he said that. He said that. Wait, what did you do with the Oh, okay, I'm finna say the nigga put the yeah, pack away, the, man. Yeah. <laughs> the pack. I'm finna smoke another one, nigga. <laughs> do you want more shrooms, by the way? I still have Fuck more. Fuck give me some more, nigga. Yeah. What's, <laughs> what's the <laughs> fuck hey. you think I am, man? You think I'm a punk or something? <laughs> you think I'm a one punk? <laughs> I'm going to leave the bag of shrooms yeah, here. Yeah, just leave the bag right here. <laughs> Why is it really close to you? Why, why Because I'm, I'm the motherfucker going to be enjoying these motherfuckers <laughs> right now. Obviously, you're not. Well, no. You that's high, why I, nigga. I want you to you put it in the middle. You won't even remember this moment. <laughs> like, where did my bag of shrooms go? <laughs> right, how long, how how long does it take to kick in? Like 30 yeah. minutes. 30, yeah. 30 to 45. How long so, has it been since they took the no, first one? No, I, I can tell you straight up. <laughs> it's kicking in. <laughs> <laughs> it's already been in. So the fact that you already took an eighth. Yeah, that's what I told my bitch. It's already been in. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Fuck that bitch. Oh, shit. Um, Gina! <laughs> this is my old girl right here. Gina, what's up? You got me. Hey, let me borrow 20 now. I'm broke. Fuck. <laughs> let me hold some. See again, mismanagement. <laughs> <laughs> if you ever hear a woman say she broke, it's mismanagement. Mm -hmm. It's mismanagement. You shouldn't be. Explain. Cash app one of them niggas. I'm just cash app them or? Right, I'm so you take, niggas, I'm going to take this Cash app request. I don't know. I, I, I don't, don't have no niggas. I'm just fucking with you. It's, uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Um, so I, I hear you have a few uh, web series coming up. Yeah, yeah, I just dropped one on Valentine's Day called Why She Keep Scratching. Go to my YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash slink, and check out Why She, Why she Keep Scratching, starring <laughs> myself, Teddy Ray, and Daphne Spring. What's, uh, what's the concept behind that? She, she keeps scratching, and the nigga uh, Leandro, he, he was trying to get her. You know what I'm talking about? Sometimes some players is just blind. Sometimes you're just blind to some of these warning signs, these red flags. Niggas run right through these red flags. And red lights. Try and red lights. Yeah. <laughs> you sound like you've been running them. <laughs> Man, I don't know. You got all kinds of camera tickets. Let's see you. Nasty dick nigga. I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> These niggas are nasty yeah. dick niggas, man. These niggas. Gabe, you ever run, run a red light? My kind of no, guy. No, no. You ran a red light before? A couple times. Gina, have you ever asked anybody to run a red light? This ain't my interview. No. Yeah. But I knew <laughs> we're, we're, we're I knew, family here. I knew, honest, I knew I, she was into the red lights when I knew she was really into Twilight. And I was like, oh, you into Dracula's. Oh. oh. 
okay. Oh, oh so that's, that's what we doing. That's I don't like level. the yeah. red light. Don't, don't, I'm cool. I don't, I'm going to stop at the red light. If yeah. Just red light, I'm cool. But what if she's like, fuck it. Red light me. <sighs> <laughs> What, she's the one egging it on though. What day? What day is she in her cycle? <laughs> right. I mean, is it is it full is it full blown gushers or or, <laughs> <laughs> or is it drying up? Is it towards the end? You know what I'm talking about? I met this girl one time in gushers. And it was probably only our second, third time being uh, intimate. And I don't like that like, shit. I and don't... she was like, she was like, yeah, let's do it. I'm like, yo, you weird for that like it was like you were waiting for this moment type shit mm -hmm. and wanted to see if i was with it like i'm crazy. cool hit me after the period because when you got dick you're gonna strike oil and i don't want to do that <laughs> <laughs> strike oil <laughs> holy shit <laughs> <laughs> Jackpot. <laughs> <laughs> Some of you niggas is in the blood, but it's cool. <laughs> What's the name of that fetish? <laughs> Somebody put it in the comments. What is the motherfucker that love bloody sex? There's some scientific name for that. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm gonna look it up right now. <laughs> That's some kinky shit. Mm -hmm. I can only imagine the motherfucker description of this video. Sling Johnson talks knowing your mama. It's, it's called the, <laughs> bloody sex. It's called the blood blood sexual vampirism fetish. Man, what? Just, I don't know. Ask Yuri. Vampirism. I bet Yuri could tell you all about it. <laughs> <laughs> so you're gonna be in the new Space Jam, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's what they say. That's what I heard. Shout out to Malcolm Lee. Thank you very much. That's fucking I, I crazy. just cast that check. Thank you. Oh shit. <laughs> Space Jam 2. That's legendary. What what uh what kind of role can you disclose that or Nope. Okay. Just you know Did you meet LeBron? Nah. Bugs nah, Bunny? I'm still trying to nah, I ain't meet that nigga. <laughs> I want to meet LeBron. I fuck with LeBron, man. I think me and LeBron are hit it off, man. I, I want to meet LeBron because that nigga's a raw ass brother. And he I, watches I like the show. What he, doing. he watches the show. What's up, Brian? Follow your nigga on the ground, man. Invite me out for some of the fun festivities with all that fly shit you be doing, nigga. Mm -hmm. Shit, nigga, Slink. Follow me, Slink Johnson, nigga. No, I'm just playing. He don't, he don't watch this show. <laughs> He gonna watch it now. <laughs> he gonna watch it now. <laughs> you a disrespectful nigga, man. <laughs> Roll crazy nigga. nigga this is disrespectful. Um, we ain't giving a fuck what's going on in the comments, huh? <laughs> hey, my nigga. No, you, you gonna read it. You gonna read it as the I, end. Okay. I, I wanna read it as it go. I like to talk oh, to okay. I like to talk to little Billy in Baltimore. <laughs> <laughs> That's the demographic for sure. Yeah. Let me one, see. One minute, twist, twist it like I twist it. Yeah. Twist some other one. Yeah, yeah. Twist that shit, nigga. I'm not talking about some weed. Twist up some more. Yeah, twist up some more. Mm -hmm. Jeremy Jimenez says everybody eat more shroom. <laughs> nah, I'm not fit to smoke no weed with Bronny, nigga. I don't fuck with kids. Is <laughs> <laughs> Slink and the Asian need a show? The Asian is named Gabe. Gabriel. Gabe C. You can call me Gabe. Gabe, you Filipino? You, I'm Filipino. They yeah. never say that's his why, name. That's why we tight because yeah. Filipinos is the niggas of the Asian community. Yeah, especially in, in LA, Southern California. <laughs> hey, you know what's crazy? I, I was watching the show, Black Jesus, and then Miss Tootie, she wanted to have a Filipino party. Why? Cause we fuck with the Filipinos, <laughs> nigga. Lupias are fire. Fuck, like, nigga. Are you crazy, nigga? We fuck with the Filipinos, nigga. Yeah. I'm going out there, nigga. <laughs> you going to the Philippines? I'm going to the Man, Philippines. I'm going nigga. with you. I'm pulling up. I'm coming you know, with you. And I'm gonna meet all y'all mamas. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, no. Do we call them titas? Titas. Yeah, titas. Ooh, My titas. Let me yeah. your tita show yeah. me your teta. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait. No, no, no. no. But they call it. Peck peck. Peck, 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 peck is is what you want. The show. Peck peck, peck peck, peck peck. 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 Yeah, I want some. Neck the most dis disrespectful thing that they say, peck peck mabaho. That means your pussy stank. Oh, that's like a. That's yeah, a that's peck a, peck it sounds like you said butthole in the back. <laughs> <laughs> peck peck mabaho. 
<laughs> that sounds like some Jackie shit. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, Slink, mm -hmm. take some more shrooms. Nigga, hit my cash app. Yep. You want to see me hit some more shrooms? Yeah. Nigga, hit my cash app. I need $500. <laughs> yeah. $500, and he's going to take a whole ounce of shrooms. Hit my shit, yep. nigga. He can take the whole, bag. Can take the whole sign, bag. Slink Johnson. The whole bag. Dollar sign Slink Johnson. Run that shit up. You said that. Yeah. But dollar sign <laughs> Slink Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> Hit my shit, nigga. Who said pull out the tatas? Yuri, we need more water, nigga. Here, <laughs> here, gotcha, gotcha, oh, gotcha. Got, got then you. I all got two down here. Okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Oh shit. <laughs> okay. Well, you. Oh, Yuri can't run him back in this moment. <laughs> um. So aside from Space Jam, uh, what are you working on next? What, what do you got it? coming up? What time is it? Seven twenty. I'm working on these niggas' mamas about nine o'clock. <laughs> oh, I'm on my shit. way over there. I'm on my way over while you out thugging with your homies. You said, uh, nigga, that knowing your mama. One of my favorite tweets is you said, "Remember when your mama took you with her to go see Uncle Ronnie?" <laughs> there goes Ronnie again <laughs> in jail. And when he got out, y'all went to see him a couple times, but your daddy was mad about it. They always used to argue, huh? <laughs> That's because your Uncle Ronnie ain't your uncle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just telling you the truth, my nigga. You know, you start thinking about these uncles, you mama. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Niggas have tapped your mama. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> hey, nigga, you remember that one time, nigga, the refrigerator went out? Motherfuckers just wasn't getting cold no more? Yeah. Mama was in between jobs. and She was working down there at the school, but it was the middle of the summer, and they didn't pick her up. It was show times in the house. You know who went and fixed that? Jose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The Mexican handyman. That nigga know your mama, nigga. Jose know your mama. He don't want no money. No, no, no. No, no, no. no, no, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> he fixed it for free. Because that nigga know your mama. <laughs> Nigga, you don't know. Yeah. Hey, what was, what was it like being on, on tour with Too Short in 99? That shit was fun, man. You know what I'm talking about? I was a young nigga. You know what I'm talking about? Being bad out here, meeting niggas' mamas. Get, get, I, little did I know I was getting all this material. It's just fun. Little niggas, come on, pull your panties out your ass, nigga. Relax. Mm -hmm. Put your man purse down, man. Cool. <laughs> and don't shoot a nigga. <laughs> I don't know yo mama. <laughs> come on. <laughs> but I probably could have cracked the bitch had I been <laughs> had I been in her area. I probably could have cracked that bitch. You know what I'm saying? You, you said uh, me and your mama don't talk no more, but me and your aunt Candace are a hundred to this day. <laughs> yeah, that's how I be sometimes. That's how Not I be a sometimes. Tattoo one. Oh, oh yeah, I was with her when she went to get her first tattoo. <laughs> It's your daddy name. It's your daddy name. She really, really loved that dude. Really loved that dude. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why he wasn't there with her to get the tattoo, but I, I was there with her. You know what I'm saying? I've been her friend 25 years he now, said, nigga. He said, your mama had her game banging face, too. I remember she had a crush on Dula her whole senior year. She used to have Paru Love playing on the voicemail greeting until she started liking New York niggas. <laughs> niggas know your mama. <laughs> Not when you said she uh, did all that shit. Read the one where he said back in '94. You, you got that one up? <laughs> no, that's the that's the one that link. No, no, no. He says or back in '94, your mama used to hang out in the low bottoms with your aunt Tammy. <laughs> your daddy knew Tammy was scandalous and didn't trust it. He went over to catch them doing something. They caught your mama in the car with someone from Villains. He cried all the way home. <laughs> <laughs> he was hurt. I remember that day. You know what I'm saying? He he had his fresh the Jabot suit on and shit. He was. Gonna try to look good for your mama, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> he said, if you ever watched the 1999 documentary, Pimps Up Hoes Down, watch the opening credits very closely. Slow it down if you have to. Tell me who you see. <laughs> Niggas know your mama. <laughs> I'm just saying, you that don't make her a bad person. That don't make her a bad person. That just, she just human, my nigga. You do dumb shit. Everybody do dumb shit. It's cool, you know what I'm saying? She did some shit that, you know, might not have been favorable today but she had a lot of fun you know what i'm talking about it was good so let your mama live a little bit but just know niggas know your mama <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> I think my favorite one when he, when he said, "Yo, your dad took your mama to West Side Connection concert at the sports arena once. Why'd he do that? He went to get refreshments, comes back, and she's gone. Where was she? In the low rider on stage throwing up the dub. He got mad and left her, but she got home. Yo, mama, she was trying to, she really wanted to suck Ice Cube dick that night, but she couldn't get close enough. I think she got one of them crib niggas, though. I think she got one of them. I'm just saying. Dub C know your mama. <laughs> yeah, Dub C know your mama, nigga. He know your mama. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's fucking hilarious. Um, we got some new music that dropped <laughs> real quick before we get out of here. Um, Petty, Petty and Draco dropped a whole project called uh, Out of Character. Mm-hmm. Um, Lil Deuce 3400 dropped Outside. That shit is hard. I'm playing that shit this week on the radio. Yeah, uh, YS from Compton. Mm-hmm. Um, he got shout out to YS. That nigga was in one of my videos, man. Oh, yeah. Pop, pops, pull up, man. YS, what up, man? Yeah, shout much out love, YS, YS hey. man. Shout out to that nigga, YS, nigga. Yeah, he got bumped in the beach free- featuring Crispy Life Kid, which is super dope. Produced by Energy. Um, the homie Tutti Guapo dropped Certified Player, mm-hmm. a real dope EP. Yep. And um, man, R.I.P. Catchy the Great. I don't want to rest in peace, catchy. Rest I don't want to bring it up sure. in the beginning because I don't want to bring down the energy. But yeah. that should have been on my mind, you know, yeah. ever since it happened. It happened earlier today. It sadly. just happened, yeah, a couple hours before. Man, L.A. Legend, L.A. Legend, been around since the jerking days. Was known as one of the best jerkers in the city before he ever started rapping. Mm-hmm. Uh, he was incarcerated for the past three years. Uh, he got out about maybe four or five months ago. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what happened, but regardless, you know, family. Long live, long yeah, live. Catchy the Sending great. love to his family, all the Please. stinks, hit mob, yeah. our baron. Um, yeah, man, just sucks, man. So much tragedy uh, associated with with the stink team. It's been mm-hmm. unfortunate, but you know, everybody hold their heads up. Um, yeah, not not much else. Not much else to say. He's a legend, man. We we booked no. him for mad shows. Mm-hmm. Always brought sure. good energy. He was here about a month ago. He pulled mm-hmm. up with Draco. Yeah, uh, it was the last time I seen him. Mm-hmm. And yeah, man, it's super, super unfortunate. I'm glad we got to at least have that moment with him here yeah. on that on the show. Yeah, no, definitely. It's um, That's <clears throat> yeah, RP man, it's just sad. Yeah. Um, you guys have any yo who's that picks? Mm, yeah, yo yeah. Man. You wanna go first? Go ahead, go ahead Gina. We sound like you was ready. No, no, no you go. <laughs> Ladies first. Um, the artist name is Jinx. He just dropped a project called Sorry for the Wait. Um, really cool project. I believe this is his first one too, and it sounds great. It sounds like he's been doing music for longer than you know most people, mm-hmm. and um, it sounds really good. He have a whole team behind him. They're called BME. Okay. Um, they got a couple other artists coming out, and everybody just has this like star power. So they're That's young. Fine. I'm excited to see what they're gonna be doing in the next few years. And um, Hattie F. He dropped "Turn Your Boss Up." Um, I don't know if y'all know who Hattie is. He's a play for the Rams, actually. Really? Yeah. Um, he uh, is a part of the, from the, the district area. Okay. Um, we got to get him on, too. But, um, yeah, he used to play for the Rams um, for a few years, and now he's doing music, boxing, tennis, the nigga doing everything. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, but, now his project is great, too. Um, and he's actually a great um, rapper, I would say. Okay, dope. Gabe, your pick? Um, mine's... <clears throat> My bad. The shroom is kicking. <laughs> but um, mine is actually from Compton. You know, uh, got a shout out to the homie Wally Sensei. Wally Sensei. He just dropped a, a amazing tape. It's called 14's Love. You know, something special for the Valentine's, mm-hmm. Valentine's Day. But uh, my record specifically has to be the one with Kalen, and it's called Come Slide. Fire. I got to yeah. hear that. Yeah. And while we're talking about Wally, uh, RIP to... Yeah. His boy, um, yeah. Nebula Swavy. Mm-hmm. He passed like, Nebula a Swavy. few weeks ago, I believe. Yeah. Shout out to them. Mm-hmm. And um, I just played his record, too, like six months ago, and I told him, and then he was just so happy yeah. about the situation. And so to be able to have that interaction, you know, yeah. is dope. RP to him. Long and, live. Uh, yeah. My pick is uh, Lil Deuce, again, outside. Just incredible. Tiny mm-hmm. Young Freestyle. It's just mm-hmm. like. Jesus Christ, and, and the whole like black aesthetic of the music video, like black and white, it's yeah. and then they it's have doing re- numbers too, yeah, because yeah. it's naturally just Hard. fire. Like yeah. it's one of those things that's like it's just gonna oh. pick up, mm-hmm. and it doesn't sound like a West Coast record or nothing like that. It's just universally like fire. Mm-hmm. Shout out to shout out to whole Mac and Co team. Um, what else? Oh, Ramp has a J one of one, 
Mood Swings featuring J Wall. And um, yeah, anything else? Anything else you got to plug in? Plug in your cash app. Plug in your. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. I got to give a big shout out to right. like, this is not even anything locally, but the Judas and Black Messiah, the whole tape, the oh, whole yeah. tape yeah. from front to back. Is is such a beautiful album they put together. Whoever A and R did it was a uh, Archie Davis. Archie Davis, mm -hmm. um, Hit Boy was part of it as well. Ryan Coogler. Mm -hmm. Hit Boy is rapping on that album too. Yeah, yeah. But like, dog, those those records that they were able to put out so fucking powerful. Yeah. So if you can do me a favor, go check out every single one of those records on that album because not not one of them missed. Yeah, the I, movie. I try to watch it, but I've I haven't seen the movie yet. I got drunk and passed out. It's out. It's on um, HBO Max. I believe it came out in theaters too. I um, saw that shit, and that goddamn Bill O'Neill is a hoe. Watch the movie. <laughs> <laughs> it's a it's a real good movie. I learned a lot. I didn't even know watching it the whole time that it was a true story. So yeah, I think crazy. it's cool that we're not getting the same slavery movies over mm -hmm. and over again. Mm -hmm. We're not hearing. I mean, you know, rest in peace to Randy. You all right? I am high as fuck right now. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, know, I know you for sure feeling the shrooms now. Because I'm already oh, like knee deep. Oh, I'm feeling it, nigga. But I ain't trembling and shit. Chet. You know, I'm good. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I feel you young pot of wine, but I'm a Jedi, man. I'm a Jedi. <laughs> I feel you. <laughs> oh, shit. You're just a young pot of wine. Yeah, I am. Right. I am a young pot of wine. I will wine. let you know I am high right now. My car <laughs> never rises bubbling. And I know y'all see me over here quiet because I'm just paying respect to the yeah. conversation that must be paid. <laughs> However, there's a time and place for everything. Check it out, man. I'm Slink Johnson. Y'all make sure y'all hit my cash app at dollar sign Slink Johnson. <laughs> Please and thank you. Dollar sign Slink Johnson. Is the Cash App. You mm -hmm. can hit me on all your social media networks at Slink Johnson. Follow me on YouTube. Subscribe to my channel. Fuck with mm. me. Slink, uh, YouTube.com forward slash Slink. SmokeYoursCrew.com. Mm. Slink. SlinkJohnson.com. I know your mama. Hey, Slink. I, so what, what made you um, bring the whole show to Compton? The whole uh, Adult Swim, Black Jesus. What that, made was, you? that was Aaron Magruder's idea. Oh, really? Yeah. To bring it to Compton? Yeah, because, you know, the, the show had to be... Excuse me. Yeah. That's that nice fine tequila. Excuse me. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, Jesus in a place where, you know, in the hood. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Jesus need to be in the hood, man. Jesus is in the hood. You know what I'm saying? I think he there stronger than he than, than some of these other places. Y'all need to come on the slide on in, talk to your boy. You know what I'm talking about? Let me see what it's saying with his uh, comments. Mm -hmm. Slink Johnson for president. Yeah, You're fucking Slink right. Johnson. Yeah, let's yeah. do that. Oh, yeah. Good vibes only. Good vibes right on. Yeah, we got good <laughs> vibes. Yeah. Let me see what this is. Slink turned on. Okay, when mm -hmm. these rooms just adjusted, yeah. it's cool right yeah, now. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, I'm, you know what I'm yeah. saying? I've been over here getting well, my shit. You yeah. know what I'm talking We're about? From you the good vibe tribe. Good vibe tribe. Good vibe, good vibe is a motherfucker. Yeah. It ain't nothing but good vibes. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Make me feel real carnivorous, carnivorous, and you know what I'm real, real mackish. Mm. You know what I'm talking about. I, tell your mama to call yeah. me. Why not? Give it, the, give it the roll. But um, what did you get the name Slink Johnson from? Because first, um, Big Jo was the first one to point it out that he was uh, Slink Johnson was actually a name in the Player Haters Ball. Shout out to Dave Chappelle. No, I think, I think it was Silk. Silky oh, Johnson. Silk. Oh, Silky Johnson. Oh, yeah. It Silky was Johnson. Silky Johnson. Okay. So you, let, did you, you letting him lead you wrong. I'm sorry. You letting him lead you wrong. Big J, oh, I'm sorry. I apologize. <laughs> what did you get? What you, you can't listen to a nigga right He He wear tipless condoms. He <laughs> can't, <you> can't listen <laughs> to <laughs> Tipless condoms. <laughs> oh, shit. He kind of nigga lied to the bitch. It's like, you know, you still get the same sensation. <laughs> This nigga right here, man. I swear to God. I swear to God. I need you a can't listen to him, I need man. a tip with condom sponsorship. That's how it is. I know you a nasty dick nigga. I swear to God. Hey, Khalid, appreciate that, man. Hey, Slink, I appreciate you. Everybody go follow yeah. Slink. 
I hate to turn my back on my man uh, Rose Grand Vic, but this way this fucking set is made. I don't feel comfortable. I'm looking at this nigga. Ain't no camera over here to see my beauty, nigga. You know what I'm talking about? When I'm looking at you, that's why I keep looking. But my man Compton, I mean my man Rose Grand Vic, mm -hmm. you talking about Compton though? You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. My man Rose Grand Vic is a cool nigga. You know what I'm saying, ladies? Appreciate get that. get a nigga a chance. Get a nigga a chance. Don't worry. Yeah, about I'm trying it. to build up my my roster back up. Yeah. So sure. you know see, you mean? fucking it up talking about a roster and shit. <laughs> <laughs> he just gonna make me another number. No, mm. he gonna care about you. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, my man Rose Grand Vic. I'm in a relationship with all my mm. bitches. Oh you know man, I mean? Big Pappy, what's up? What's up? Oh shit, yeah. Thank you, ATL. You're right on. What's happening? Hey, Gina, you're getting a lot of love. Gina is so Gina, attractive. Gina, how are you? Yep. Ooh, Mexico. <laughs> Tapping in. Kyle Wong with the dolphin, whatever the fuck mm. that means. That's, that's the homie Kevin. Oh, the dolphin uh, laugh. Kyle, Kevin. Dolphin laugh. Kyle. That's the homie Kyle, Kyle Wong. He's part of the morning crew. Okay. Shout out to homie Kyle. Oh, yeah. Kyle, what's up? What's good? Yep. But yeah, Slink, like I said, appreciate you. <laughs> Everybody, follow Slink. Mm-hmm. Don't come up to him at the grocery store. He Please might be don't. trying to stuff something in his pants. Well, hit me in the parking lot. <laughs> yeah, just wait till he gets outside. Damn. Don't do him like that. You know. Don't try mean? to block me in because I'm going to run your ass over. <laughs> don't do that. Uh -huh. Appreciate you, bro. Mad Lately, we out.